Hello viewers, I hope all of you are fine. Today I want to discuss another very basic and fundamental topic which is basically the another application of electrostatic and that is inkjet printer. Before this we discuss already what is basically photocopier machine and what is the process of xerography or the process of writing. So now let's discuss the inkjet printer. Let's first discuss the construction of inkjet printer. Inkjet printer is basically consists of the ink supply system, the pump, the nozzle, electrodes, charging control system, depleting plates, gutter region and the page upon which we want to print something. So now let's discuss after this the working of inkjet printer that how it works basically those areas which uh, upon which there is writing for writing areas the computer the charging control system gives instruction to the electrode that it must uh, be turned uh, off for writing areas because we want to pick these these areas and transfer this uh, these areas to the white page and for those areas uh, upon which there is no writing the charging control system remains on and when charging control system remains on then ink uh, goes towards the gutter region so this is the main idea so that's why when the uh, uh, those areas upon which there is writing a particular page and we want to transfer that writing to the particular white page and we want to print up that on that white page so for writing areas the charging control system gives instruction to the uh, to the, uh, the electrodes that must turn off so that's why when the nozzle shutting uh, back and forth and uh, eject the ink droplets towards the paper so the ink drop droplets go straight towards the paper and deposited on paper why because the charging control system gives already instruction to the uh, electrodes that must turn off so that's why the electrodes didn't responding to the droplets because droplets are neutral in that case and the deflecting plates are uh, of no mean for their droplets because there is no charge on droplets so that's why droplets go straight and basically there is a writing areas produced on the white paper so now let's discuss those areas for uh, upon which there is no writing so for that uh, those areas the charging uh, control system gives instruction to the electrode that must turn on because we didn't want that areas to be uh, writing on that something so for that case uh, the charging control system gives instruction to the electrodes that must turn on so when the electrodes turn on and the nozzle shutting back and forth then when the droplets, uh, droplets uh, come out of the nozzle then it becomes charged when passing through the electrodes and that charging droplets charged drop, droplets when passes uh, through the deflecting plates then we know that th these deflecting plates basically deflect the charged particles are the charged ink towards the gutter region and the waste uh, are the waste ink basically uh, collected by the gutter or through gutter we can collect the uh, waste ink so i hope this is the whole process of inkjet printer and you got a basic idea about the inkjet printer so, let, so let's uh, summarize that again basically inkjet printer consists of the ink supply system, the pump, the nozzle, the electrodes, charging control system, reflecting plates, gutter and a paper upon which we want to write something. So when we we didn't want to write something on a paper so for this, those areas which are uh, means there is no writing for that the charging control system gives instruction to the electrode that must turn on so when the charge droplets passes through the electrodes it becomes charged and uh, their charge droplets uh, are deflected by the uh, uh, deflecting plates towards the gutter region and uh, waste ink is collected there and uh, those areas upon which there is a writing for that the charging control system gives instruction to the 
reflect uh, to the electrodes that must turn off and when uh, electrodes turn off then when the nozzle shutting back and forth and send uh, or eject uh, angle droplets then it, uh, we know we know that these are basically neutral droplets and it goes uh, straight uh, through the deflecting plates and uh, deposited on white paper and uh, there is a writing produced there so thanks for your time i hope you like this video subscribe this channel and uh, must watch this channel for upcoming instra instra um, interesting videos for uh, which are basically related to the historical uh, background of physics ancient history and uh, about uh, nature so thanks for your time <clears throat>